In this video we are going to see trend duct humidity and temperature sensor overview and technical data. Welcome to Controls and Systems YouTube channel. Device Overview The HTD humidity and temperature sensors can be used for a wide range of HVAC applications, operating over 0 to 100% RH range. The sensor should be supported in all IQ controllers with current, thermistor, or universal inputs. The certified 2% high accuracy and standard 3% versions offer excellent linearity and stability over a wide humidity range. They use a capacitive sensing element which exhibits excellent long-term stability and linearity. Sensor Mechanical Design Cable Entry is M20 Conduit Entry with M16 Cable Gland. Enclosure is Impact Resistant ABS. Probe is polycarbonate, flammability HB, gasket is closed cell neoprene, CR, foam rubber, filter is PTFE membrane filter, duct mounting flange is polycarbonate, connectors is two-part rising cage clamp screw terminals for 0.2 to 1.5 A squared cable. Protection for housing is IP65 and CE compatibility. Weight is 200 grams approximately. Dimensions, duct probe, length 263 millimeters, including filter, diameter is 12 millimeters, head, 105 millimeters, 57 millimeters, 97 millimeters, fixing centers, 85 millimeters. Product code and specification are indicated in the table column. Working ambient limits. Probe temperature is minus 20 degrees Celsius to plus 60 degrees Celsius. Electronics temperature is minus 5 degrees Celsius to plus 50 degrees Celsius. Humidity is 0 to 100% RH non-condensing. Storage temperature is minus 25 degrees Celsius to plus 60 degrees Celsius. Electrical data, supply voltage is 15 to 30 volt DC. Output signal for humidity is 4 to 20 mA for 0 to 100% RH. Output signal for temperature is 4 to 20 mA for 0 to plus 40 degrees Celsius. The sensor is suitable for use with Trend IQ controllers and I.O. modules and requires two separate input channels, one for humidity, one for temperature. The minimum supply voltage is 15 volt when used with a Trend IQ controller. If used with another device the minimum voltage should be calculated as follows. Also ensure sufficient current is available to power the sensor. For example, on an IQ3 the sensor IP terminal must be connected to the 24 volt terminals of both channels. Sensor wiring. This diagram indicates the HTD model sensor wire connection for the IQ3 trend controller, connection for the IQ1 and IQ2 trend controllers. This diagram indicates the HTD 2% model sensor wire connection for the IQ1 and IQ2 trend controllers, connection for the IQ3 trend controllers. The first wire is connected in the IP terminal, which is 24 volt. The second wire is connected in the IN terminal, which is humidity signal. The third wire is connected in the TH terminal, which is 0 volt. The fourth wire is connected in the TH terminal, which is temperature signal. The quick release lid gives access to a PCB featuring a two part screw terminal block. Mechanical data the sensor can either be mounted directly onto the duct or by using the optional mounting flange. Using the flange enables the depth of the probe to be adjusted. Direct mounting requires the junction box to be secured using two number six screws. A 15 mm hole must be drilled, cut into the duct for the probe. The supplied foam gasket is used to provide a good seal around the probe entry hole. Flange mounting requires the optional ACC flange 12-5 flange to be fitted. A 23 mm clearance hole must be drilled or cut into the duct and the flange secured using four screws. The probe is then secured at the required depth by tightening the clamp screw. Humidity, 
Humidity operating range is 0 to 100% RH non-condensing. Humidity element is capacitive RH element. Linearity, stability, humidity accuracy of HTD and HTD 2% sensor model ranges and specification are shown in the table column. Temperature dependence of the probe, electronics, hysteresis, resolution, response time, load resistance and humidity output signalive ranges and specification are shown in the table. Temperature. Temperature measurement range is 0 to plus 40 degrees Celsius. Temperature element for HTD model sensor is thermistor 10 kilo ohm at 25 degrees Celsius. HTD 2% model sensor is PT1000. Temperature accuracy. Temperature output signal of HTD and HTD 2% sensor model ranges and specification are shown in the table column. Field maintenance. The removal of dust, accuracy checking, and calibration is covered in the HTD installation instructions. The accuracy of the sensor should be checked annually. If the sensor falls outside the quoted accuracy replace the filter and recalibrate. Ammonia should not be used to clean the duct as it may affect the sensor. Calibration data. The humidity sensing part of the HTD sensor may be manually calibrated by the user. This involves keeping the sensor and the humidity reference chamber in the same room for at least 4 hours prior to the calibration. The humidity chamber should be thoroughly cleaned before use. The humidity sensing probe should be placed in the humidity chamber at least 30 minutes prior to the calibration. A dirty filter cap should be replaced prior to calibration. During calibration the temperature must be kept constant. The calibration is performed by using the two push buttons on the rear of the sensor PCB. The calibration LED will illuminate while the calibration is in progress. The sensor is supplied pre-calibrated for ease of commissioning. It is also recommended that the accuracy of the sensor is checked every 12 months and recalibrated if necessary. Fault finding, fault 1 is long response time. Possible causes filter polluted. Remedy is clean filter. Fault 2 is complete failure. Possible cause is no power supply. Remedy is check power supply and cable. Fault 3 is humidity reading too high. Possible cause is condensation on sensor probe. Remedy is remove filter and carefully dry the probe. Well I hope this video is useful to you. Thank you for watching our videos. Have a great day.